Hello Sagittarius! Hi! How are you doing? Welcome into my channel. This is Sage Sunset. I am an intuitive card reader, so I'm here to present intuitive messages for you using the Divine Tarot cards. I'm getting message for your finance, your money and career for the upcoming seven days ahead Sagittarius. Welcome in, welcome in. Thank you so much for being here and I do hope you find messages here that are able to resonate with you. Alright, so Sagittarius, when I was shuffling, I felt an energy that someone is being guided or led by a father figure. So this is a, a career reading. So I feel like your work attitude is very much inspired by a person that you hold dear to you, someone that you look up to. Someone that has work, their work ethics were very powerful. They were committed and determined. There's a word that I'm looking for, like their work, gosh. Yeah, so just the way how they, they worked. I feel like you're inspired by that and it there it is instilled in you. So I'm feeling a father figure judgment, right? Being guided, I feel, by this energy. This person could have been someone that was spiritual, someone who believed in God, believed in the Bible, who believed in morals, stability, who believed in integrity, who yeah, who had stability in their more in their faith. So this is a father energy here, Leo. I'm sorry, Sagittarius. I just did Leo reading. I'm Sagittarius, and they're very inspirational in your reading. This person, I feel, is connected to your heart. So Leo, I feel like you're moving toward being more financially balanced and stable. Judgment has called it because you've been working. I feel like, sorry, did I say Leo again? Sagittarius. So I feel like you've been working hard to move in a direction where you have enough to give you feel good about yourself you know you're taking care of your family and it's actually coming from this place of love this person instilled like a high sense of morality in you this father energy so you have love in you and you're moving to stability feeling feeling good feeling prosperous right now why the seven of pentacles you working building streaming in income for you putting your work on display movement you could be on a platform working on a platform working your work here yeah, so you're working diligently on a platform whatever that means for you away by yourself working working through your emotions your heart space too feeling good about the work that you're doing having a having work come into you experienced worker i feel like you're an experienced worker worker who is setting the stage for greater stability stability in 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 wealth in material success and in love i feel like there's a love energy backing your finances this father figure is so present here so powerful as if they live through you you keep them within your energy and even when you're making, I feel like crying. I don't know why. Oh my gosh. <laughs> it's like even when you're making decisions, the Sagittarius, this person's energy comes through to you and you remember them. You remember what they were like. You remember their nature. And I feel like this person, they keep you grounded. It could be a father. This is also a, per a CEO, business-minded and older person, experienced, wise, who creates balance. Whew, okay oh my gosh balance coming into your financial stability i feel and backed even by your emotions the way you carry yourself sagittarius you're normally very emotionally i would say stable but i feel like it kind of you you're not you don't really express your emotions like some signs wear their heart on their sleeves you you're very loving but it is it's like on the second surface <laughs> so the first layer of you is fun outgoing always giving jokes smiling uh having fun the life of the party people love your energy yes beautiful energy but and the second level of you your second layer is just love i feel like pure love so maybe you've been expressing that love a lot you've been focusing on working finding stability and also working on your ideas of self-worth your sense of value 
building up your sense even working on your emotions i feel working on your emotions and this will help you to be more grounded in 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 your business get what i'm saying sagittarius what are you good at loving on yourself too this is new love a wave of new energy coming in through you new appreciation some of you could be feeling a little bit imbalanced when it comes to money or just your sense of self-worth and that's why you're putting in the work empress alrighty so I see you're very intuitive Sagittarius as a fire sign emotional too I'm passionate passionate about what it is that you do driven purposeful you you enjoy nature things of nature like natural things like the water the river you enjoy the breeze like these subtle little things you don't really always express them outwardly like some people would do for example a more emotional sign like a cancerian would express their emotions right but you subtly enjoy the breeze that just blew past you you're, you're you you appreciate things beautiful things found in nature very intuitive energy and i feel you do have this divine connection to a person that helps to keep you grounded this person instilled i feel like it is a father figure that instilled certain ideas in you and it helps you to this day to be the person that you are oh my gosh the king of pentacles grounded you love feeling stable financially you your business maybe some of you have a business that you're starting out wanting it to be stable financially just working toward you know ensuring that your business is set straight in money coming into you prosperity success and joy feel looking good feeling good too this is an earth sign energy as well as this the emperor card is also earth energy for me and earth energy is taurus virgo capricorn This is an energy of, I feel like glowing, glowing, heat, passion, essence, light, movement, like energy flowing could be through you. This is your card, Sagittarius, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, those are the fire signs. Yes, so that's, that's it, energy, passion, as if you're working, you're in, you're in momentum, you're in the heights of your career the heights of your business some of you could be leaving a person behind or leaving a lifestyle behind and moving forward to a new identity of establishing your business being grounded a new taste for, for life moving forward Sagittarius Wow you again coming in moving into your innate abilities the wands cards are Sagittarius energy here a new business setting up for some of you aligning with another person in business Sagittarius new business ideas you just feeling grounded like like you're having new ad things you're thinking about things when it comes to money businesses work that you've never really thought about before but you look good you're dealing with, with it well from a mature place as if you're ready to take on the journey ahead of you you're, you've been handed this gift whatever it is that you're good at that's laughter making people laugh just making the situation light being light-hearted knowing how to hold your grounds hold your emotions all of you Sagittarius you person you specifically that I'm reading for your essence is going to be put into a business and it's going to be good for you it's, it's like it's your business because it is a part of who you are in essence a message could be coming in sale movement a message coming in swiftly to you feeling good too this card is my fabulous card like gone with the wind fabulous feeling good maybe some of you are resisting something coming through to you maybe some of you are resisting or blocking something from your past that wasn't serving you moving forward 
Page of Swords could also mean that you're watching someone. You're looking at a person, at someone or a business. You're looking into something new. And this is someone watching you. Being, of being in your position of authority here. Being able to make decisions swiftly. Something coming into you swiftly. Somebody could be spying on you. But I feel you could be the spyer. You could be the one that's spying here. But let me know. <laughs> well, another sword's energy here. Uh, some of you may be coming up on a bit of a stumbling block when it comes to moving past certain obstacles. Obstacles in the home, perhaps. Obstacles in yourself. What you're defending in yourself. What are you defending in yourself? So this home is also within your body. Needing to overcome, to get past this phase. It's like climbing a mountain. It's so steep, but you know you're going to get over there. As if maybe you have to leave things behind and it is hard, but you have your boundaries intact and that's going to get you through. Some of you could be blocking a connection with other people that you don't understand or, you, or, or who misunderstand you. Come, cutting off connection to cutting connections of interference. Uh, actually moving with your energy. Your energy of stability. Okay. Oh my. I was about to say deciding to go with your heart. Instead of fussing, just deciding to take, instead of having that resistance, Sagittarius, in, in your home. It's something that surrounds your home life. Could be deciding to go with something that is much easier for you taking the simpler road sometimes we try not to take the simpler road because we feel like losers i don't know for lack of a better word but sometimes the simpler road is what is designed for you to trod on and that is why it is simpler because it's already been designed for you easier so you're going with the current instead of battling against the current and going with the current i feel is moving you into a place of just wholesomeness, feeling like you do have much to give here. The six of pentacles, equal give and take, feeling prosperous and abundant, having to share. This is you, I feel, sharing emotional stability with others, just being there to help people get through situations, just being a pillar of support, emotional support for those in your home. And this could be someone that is emotionally supportive to you, Sagittarius coming in to offer you affection, to offer you peace, maybe this is peace, an apology, clarity, some rejuvenation as if you've been working hard out in the sun and someone is bringing you a glass of water for you to cool down and that is metaphorical, as if you've been struggling or going through hard times and you're being replenished, it's time for you to be replenished. Financial stability. So yes, you're securing the bag. Look at this. Securing the money. Planting. So I feel like planting your money. And when I say that, I mean making it grow for you. Putting it in soil, which is fertile. Like investing it in business that's going to grow your money. Having something to money to stand on. Be firm. Having value in yourself too. Holding on to your integrity, your sense of value. Knowing the direction in which you are heading, Sagittarius. Being backed or, or supported by this father energy, fatherly figure energy. Some of you could be, you know, fathers, older people that have to really be focusing on ensuring that you have generational wealth for those that are coming after you. Okay? All right, let's see, Sagittarius, what your next card will be. Wow. The lover's energy angelic guidance messages i feel like messages from heaven messages from loved ones from the past messages from loved ones that resonate with your frequency this could be you coming into alignment with a twin flame a soulmate love energy that's a heart connection this could be you coming into a, a love connection with your higher self 
your love, justice, judgment, calling here, knowing what it is that you bring to the table, connecting, asking questions inside. I feel like really connecting to your heart. Your higher self is here, this heavenly body is present within you, right? So these people are looking up, but it's actually inside of you. And I think you're feeling this energy of, of um, consulting with your inside self first, your inner wisdom. And this could also be consulting with that energy of the fatherly figure, wondering what they would do, how they would respond, how they would feel. And so you do have heavenly bodies present in your energy. So beautiful blessings. And finally, we're going to look at the bottom of the deck to see, ooh, victory. Victory for you. And this is your energy as well, fire. Moving in the direction that you're passionate about. Moving on your path, Sagittarius. Really just finally aligning with your gifts, your talents, your true nature, loving on yourself. It's causing you to move forward. Moving from fives to six, evolving, right? Evolving in love for yourself and evolving in sense of wealth. Sense of wealth meaning you feel valuable inside and out. So you're moving in the direction, you're probably leading, helping a lot of people too to set up their businesses, to start earning. You feel graceful and confident here grounded so you're moving with your your passion your desires your intuition that's your gut feeling your internal knowing your heavenly awareness awareness of a guidance present that's helping you through you know tapping into your emotional sense out in nature too you know taking this gift that you have with you and being grounded in it and you're being applauded for that, really. Okay, Sagittarius, this is the end of your reading. Thank you so much for being here. And I do hope you found messages that help you on your journey. Sagittarius, give this video a thumbs up, don't want you. Um, in, in respect of supporting my channel's growth and development, thank you for being a part of my journey and may we continue to share this journey together. And on your way out, Sagittarius, do remember that you can be, do have everything and anything in this life that you desire. Dream big because you are all and all is within you. All is within you. Peace, much love.